Samsung's flagship phones took a big leap forward this year with the Samsung Galaxy S20 and Samsung Galaxy Z Flip, and that could continue with the highly anticipated Samsung Galaxy Note 20. Like this year's upgrade to the Galaxy S series, the next Galaxy Note Fablet could be a major step up from last year's models, with some key display and camera improvements that could make one of the best big phones even better. And based on recent rumors we've heard, you won't have to wait very long for the Note 20 to arrive. Samsung Flash's smartphone which is now confirmed as reported on Samsung Newsroom they have officially started the mass production for the fastest storage for flagship smartphone that is up 3.1 and that is up to 512 gigabytes of memory which is absolutely insane before I get into the exciting scoop I do and so the new F3.1 will make the Galaxy Note 20 family faster than the S20 Ultra which which still has the UFS 3.0 implementation according to Samsung 100 GB file can move in just 1.5 minutes versus 4 minutes on the UFS 3.0 stories you're getting around 60% performance upgrade and this could also help in the faster app launch this definitely confirms the next level for the Galaxy Note 20 family and for the Galaxy for second generation if you guys remember the last year's fall was the first Samsung to device to come with UFS 3.0 storage so this could actually come with the fall to us well in addition to the Note 20 family now Samsung has done some amazing advancements when it comes to smartphone camera and here in 2020 the numbers are as crazy as they can get but seems like Samsung might go beyond a 108 megapixel according to a new report coming from Korean Chinese brands like Vivo Oppo and Xiaomi have requested Samsung to make a 200 megapixel sensor but because of technical difficulties that is not possible but what is possible is a 150 megapixel sensor according to the report Samsung is working on world's first 150 megapixel smartphone sensor just like they did with the 108 MP sensor which was at the time the first sensor ever on a smartphone according to the report Samsung is developing the world's first 150 MP smartphone sensor this is again a rumor coming from Korea just like last year's 108 MP sensor which was first featured in a Xiaomi flagship phone this 150 MP could also do the same so it might go first in the Xiaomi phone in the second late half of this year and then eventually we're gonna see this on Samsung's own flagship phone well just like they did with the Galaxy S20 Ultra they built a custom version of Fade which they call as one sensor now the new 150 MP sensor is said to be bigger in size it's going to have an output of 16 megapixel photos instead of 12 megapixel using the non binning technology and of course in addition to producing full 150 MP photos so full size will go even higher the 150 MP sensor may not be a huge improvement compared to the the 108 megabytes of the Galaxy S20 Ultra but it'll definitely look good for advertising once again it's rumored that Xiaomi will use the sensor for the first time in the second half of this year the chances of this coming on Galaxy Note 20 family is very slim but again Samsung could surprise us or else we're just gonna see this on the Galaxy S21 most likely so in the future Samsung will bring even more megapixels to the the table but what's already in the mass production is the UFS 3.1 storage which is most likely gonna be ready for the Note 20 family at the launch which is gonna happen in the month of August also in response to everything that is going on in the world Samsung has decided to protect your phone there's a brand new galaxy sanitizing service which is absolutely free so you can go there and sanitize your phone with the UV light so if you want your phone to be cleaned in addition to your hands of course then be sure to check out the galaxy sanitizing surveys with that being said if that is it for this news I'm happy to see the current news definitely some exciting stuff is planned for the future this Samsung will be heating global market with their best smartphone ever thanks for watching see you on my next video